Hello everybody. Today's a question asked through the WhatsApp. So the question is from current electricity. A current in a wire is given by the equation I is equal to 2t squared minus 3t plus 1. The current is given in the form of an equation. The charge through cross section of wire in time interval of 3 seconds to 5 seconds. They give the current. This is nothing but I. I is equal to 2t squared minus 3t plus 1. We need to find out the charge. Q. Amount of charge. We know the very basic formula of current. I is equal to dq by dt. From this equation, dq is equal to I into dt. We need of dq. Q, we need to find out the value of Q so that I am going to take the integration on both sides. So what we can get? dq becomes Q. Substitute the value of I here. 2t squared minus 3t plus 1 into dt. That is the limit of 3 to 5. It is varying with respect to the time from 3 seconds to the 5 seconds. First, we need to take the integration. So, take the integration that is q is equal to 2 into t squared integration of limit of 3 to 5 dt. The dt is common for every terms. So, minus 3. 3 is a constant. That is why taken outside. Integration of t limit of 3 to 5 dt plus this is dt only integration of a dt limit is 3 to 5 what we arrived here t integration of t squared is nothing but t power 3 by 3 limit is 3 to 5 same way here 3 integration of d dt this is nothing but t squared by 2 the limit is 3 to 5 plus dt becomes t limit of 3 to 5. Now apply the limit. This is q is equal to 2 by 3. Take the constant time outside so that we can get d cube. So this is nothing but 5 cube minus 3 cube. The first term minus 3 by 2 t squared limit for t squared this is nothing but 5 squared minus 3 squared plus 5 minus 3 do the calculations so 2 by 3 into 125 5 cube minus 3 cube this is nothing but 27 minus 3 by 2 5 squared 25 minus 9 squared 3 squared 9 plus 2 okay then 2 by 3 125 minus 27 that is 98 minus 3 by 2 16 plus 2 this is nothing but we can classify we can strike out 8 times this 3 9 it's 3 times remaining 8 8 is 6 2 times remaining 2 that is 6 another 6 6 6 it goes on that's why i am putting 6 7 so multiply 2 this is this will give 14 remaining 1 12 13 remaining 1 2 2 4 1 5 this 2 into 3 that is 65 minus 24 plus 2 this is nothing but 65.34 minus 22 that will give 4 3 5 minus 2 that is 3 6 minus 2 that is 4 so the charge which passing through the cross sectional area is that's q 
is equal to 43.34 coulomb. Thanks for watching everybody. Thanks all of you.